Tonight, military aircraft are back home in Lemoore after a seven-month deployment. Hundreds of personnel were met by their spouses, children, and loved ones with lots of hugs and kisses. Our Alexa Bertola was there for the sweet homecoming at the Naval, Naval Air Station in Lemoore. After months away, dozens of these F-18s returned here to Lemoore, but that wasn't even the best part of the day. VFA 41 Squadron overhead returning home to Naval Air Station Lemoore. Loved ones waiting, anxiously snapping photos, cheering. Very, very excited, very, very exhausted, very, very ready for dad to come home. I haven't seen him since October, and since then a lot of life has happened. A new bundle of joy. Lieutenant John Tuziant met his son, three-month-old Reed, for the very first time. It's hard to describe. Uh, emotions. He also reunited with his other baby who was crawling when he left but is now walking. Overwhelming uh, and very big relief to be home. The squadron left 210 days ago. Every email that we exchange at the end of the night uh, countdown. Aboard aircraft carrier USS John C. Stennis, the F-18s performed combat operations in Afghanistan and the Arabian Gulf. Miles away, another baby, Victoria Hope, was welcomed into the world. She was born 10 days after we deployed, so I spent the entire cruise worrying about them. She's the Cummins' first baby together. I've thought about homecoming since the day he left. 12 aircraft on the ground now back home safe, families reunited after a mission complete. I'm so stoked that he's finally back. And a total of four squadrons returned here to NAS Lemoore today. Reporting from base, I'm Alexa Bertola for KC24, local news that matters.